Good afternoon guys, this is Mike Fowler at Orange County Telescope. We just received a brand new telescope in. It's uh, Celestron's new uh, First Scope 76 Cosmos Edition. Uh, PBS is coming out, uh, I believe it's March 9th, with uh, the new version of Cosmos. And this is, uh, in conjunction with them, a line of telescopes that they are um, uh, coming out with that look absolutely beautiful. And some of them, the, the higher end versions, have uh, Wi-Fi, which is groundbreaking technology. But uh, this is their first scope 76. It uh, is going to retail for $69.95. Um, it is a tabletop telescope. And I just figured we'd look uh, and see what's in the box here. We have uh, instructions. And if you're like uh, most uh, astronomy enthusiasts that I know, the first thing they do with the instructions, throw them away. You pretty much don't need those, right? We'll probably need those later, so uh, we'll let gravity take care of them right now. This is uh, a beautiful telescope. Uh, I'll see if we can. This is the first time I've opened up this box, so figure out how they pack this thing in here safely. It looks like we just have a, a little piece of cardboard there holding it, and then we have everything is already pre assembled, which is nice. Uh, we have one few things to put together, so not completely pre assembled, but we open up the bag here. A beautiful uh, optical tube. It has a neat design on it. Looks like the lens cap has come free in uh, transportation there. Just going to open this up, point it the right direction. There we go. Wow, that is beautiful. has a neat little uh, nebulosity on the outside. I'll hold it up close here. There you go. Cosmos. It's a uh, Dobsonian design. It's a Newtonian reflector. And it looks like it, uh, it in the uh, accessory box here, it comes with uh, two additional Kellner eyepieces, says the uh, list of items. Yeah, it's got a uh, 20 millimeter eyepiece, which is going to be your lowest power. You're always going to want to start with that 20 millimeter eyepiece. That's going to give you your widest field of view. And this uh, is also coming with the red dot finder, which is something their first scopes uh, historically have not come with. So this is going to give you the ability to uh, just two little bolts right there, that'll slide right in. Uh, illuminator, this turns on, puts a red dot up in the sky, makes it much easier for the first time viewer uh, to uh, find objects um, that, that uh, uh, you can see easily, but when you're looking through the telescope, oftentimes the field of view is so narrow, even at the lowest power, it can be difficult to find. So it's nice that they included that. Overall, I would tell you, this is a beautiful telescope, very capable. Uh, historically, the 76 millimeter telescopes are great for the moon, planets, uh, something that's really grab and go, something easy. If you're looking for uh, something that's portable, uh, not too expensive, uh, to see, to check your level of interest in astronomy, uh, and obviously, this is a, a beautiful telescope.